Sally, I, I know I brought you to a rock when I said I'd take you to prom, but will you ever be able to forgive me? I'll forgive you when pigs fly. Lift just in. There's a giant pork on us. Get this. Flying through fucking space. Reports claim it's coming to devour our planet. Is this the end of the world as we know it? Find out if I, if we last that long. So, do you forgive me now? Hey, all the people down at Gillen are freaking over some pig god, apparently. Yeah, there's some dangerous pig goddess coming to Gillenor. <laughs> I guess we'll be safe on Xenaris. Yeah, it eats planets, so I guess we're safe on a moon. I guess that means Pluto's safe, too. <laughs> <laughs> What's Pluto? Well, you managed to survive being ejected from a car into a glass building where all the glass shards punctured 90% of your body and then the truck that you crashed into spilled all of the toxic chemicals it was carrying onto your open wounds. And an old lady who was for some reason carrying an open container of salt tripped and all the salt went flying onto those open wounds. And of course, all of this happening just days after you win your lifelong battle with cancer. Frankly, I'm not sure how you're still alive, but we'll be discharging you from the hospital tomorrow. It was my dream that kept me alive. I've always wanted to be a dentist. And now that I have my degree, and I've survived all these terrible things, I'll be able to live that dream. So it turns out the pig's name is Pumpa. Sorry, Tuska. And uh, we're all definitely going to die. I quit this job, and my boss is a total prick. No. No, no, no! God was gonna have a future! God was gonna have a future! I was gonna have a future! Dude, I never thought I'd tell someone that they were overreacting to the apocalypse, but you are overreacting to the apocalypse. I was gonna have a future! <laughs> I think I left the stove on on the last planet I was on. Should I go back? Just do it! Fine. You're so demanding. Holy shit, I can't believe we survived that.